let's see, we started off like day one with Greg, uh, just kind of uh, walking us through uh, Git and, and basically getting us started how to uh, to branch our code off and, and you know work in teams and things like that. Um, it's all logical problem solving. That's basically what you're doing here. There's a lot of parallels between being a lawyer. Uh, even the, the, the test that I took to get in here is very similar to the test I took to get into law school. It's logical problem solving at its lowest levels. And, and um, once you can kind of learn the language, uh, you know, get the syntax down for the different codes you're gonna learn, uh, it's, it's after that it's just figuring out how to get the answers you want from the data that you're getting. So after the training was over, uh, I started actively looking, even before the class was over, uh, we started, I think almost everyone in our class here started looking for that new job. And it took about, I think about a month, a month and a half for me. Um, I had a couple interviews leading up to the, the actual job offer where I ended up getting a job on Health Carousel. So my best advice would be to take really good notes because you're not gonna understand everything that's being told you and being taught to you at the time you're getting it. You're gonna get some of it, you're not gonna get all of it. You look back at your code, your notes, you know, after you've been coding a little while, and that stuff's gonna make a lot more sense and it's gonna be you know, good, valuable information to have. Um, and as far as you know, the school here goes, you're not gonna find a better school than this in town. I mean, they've just got connections all over town. They have a very great, you know, very well-known and a great reputation in town. As far as technical schools go, you're not gonna find a better one.